I'm moving over to assignment number 14 where we are going to talk in terms of a totally new branch of mathematics that is algebra. In class 6, we do three branches of mathematics that is arithmetic, algebra and geometry. So, we've already done arithmetic. Now we are moving over to algebra. It's very important for us to understand what is algebra. So, before I go deeper into it, let's understand arithmetic and algebra. What is there in arithmetic? Arithmetic will contain all the numbers, be it 15, 0, negative 5, that means all of them are integers, all kinds of fractions, and all kinds of decimals. Now, all these numbers are used along with the signs that we have come, come across addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, equal to, not equal to, greater than, less than, implies that, etc. So, all these signs and the numbers are put together in arithmetic. In algebra now, we've got alphabets. Alphabets along with these numbers that we have. Sorry. Along with these numbers will give us. So we could have something like 2x, 5x, 2, or 5x upon 2, minus 5x. So what we see here are our, our alphabets as well as numbers. They are mixed together. And along with them, we use all the signs that we use in arithmetic. All the rules and regulations that are followed in arithmetic are also followed in algebra. The only new thing that has actually come are the alphabets. Now, now when we look at the alphabets, if you look at your assignment number 14, on top I have already given that you should write the particular alphabets in a particular way. The reason why I'm saying this, I've written all the alphabets, some of the alphabets that I've written here. This is the method of writing our alphabet. Why? Because we are using the multiplication sign. If you write x like this, then when in algebra I multiply x multiplied by x, yours will be looking like this. Similarly, a B to be written very clearly because sometimes it may look like a 6. Similarly, Z may be looking like a 2. Or Y may be looking like a 4. And S may be looking like a 5. So be very, very careful when you write down these alphabets when it comes along with the numbers and the signs. 